What's up, spectators? Welcome back to the episode of Nier. Last time we fought A2. Was that her designation? Something like that. And now we're coming to Pascal to ask about A2, or whatever her designation is. I'm surprised you wish to speak with me personally. Whatever is the matter? It'll be faster if you just take a look at this recording. I see. Information about this A2 android is indeed contained within our archives. We all understand her to be rather dangerous. However, she's never visited our village in person. My apologies. That's all the information I have. I see. Alright, thanks. Let's stay sharp and head back to the Resistance camp. We should run a check on our consciousness data and resupply. Consciousness data? Got it. 9S, why did you ask Pascal about A2? Huh? It's not recommended to interface with machines without consulting command. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. Though I suppose such intense curiosity can be admirable in its own way. <laughs> <laughs> to be. Oh. Still, machines are the enemy. Don't forget it. I've got mail. That's not what I meant to push. Ah, oh, that's spam. I can't believe they send me spam. Operator 210 to 9S. This is your regularly scheduled contact. Yeah, yeah. No problems here. Copy that. I also need to inform you that the Commander offers her personal praise for your recent achievements. As a direct result, we are currently considering boosting production of your model. Really? I'm happy to hear it. I couldn't have done it without your support, Operator. You're always so cool under fire, not to mention beautiful and... Flattery is unnecessary. Operator 210, out. I really meant it, though. Ah, you're pretty smooth, guy. More me's to dilute me? Oh, 2B. Your timing is impeccable. Our android forces currently have a carrier deployed in the Pacific Ocean. It should be back here to resupply before too long. The Resistance is assisting with the mission, so I'd like to ask you to run a little guard duty. Seriously? Dead serious. There's a stockpile of missiles down at the shoreline that needs to be loaded on the carrier. And with all the machine activity lately, we need to stay on our toes. Of course, if you're already working on something for Yorha, I don't mind if that takes priority. Anyway, thanks in advance. Now, I think this is the one where once you accept the mission, you lose all these quests. So why don't we be very... Oh, wait a minute. This is the destination? I mean, we could probably do that. There's someone in the village, though. Who is that? Oh, you? I need a favor. We're planning a recon expedition to the forest, but before we can start, we need someone to head in there and set up a satellite camp. The enemies are tough. I'd lose a lot of good people if we tried to clear them out. Head to the woods. Alright, I can do that. It's no problem. Alright, turns out if you actually want to talk to these guys, you have to hack them, which looks pretty easy. Got him. That voice couldn't have been that machine's thoughts, right? Was it seriously trying to figure out the meaning of existence? Negative. Machine life forms do not possess such thought routines. Well, yeah, but... Do I just keep... going? Oh. I didn't mean to do that. Whoops. Looks like, yeah, we got another wise machine on our hands. Hold on. I don't have time for these other guys. You need to chill out, guy. All these nihilistic robots. 
What the hell was that? It's in Peyton because it can't find value in its own existence. It wants to know why it's here. And what about me? Why am I here? Alert. Hacking has resulted in an alignment of synaptic transmissions. Oh, right. Sorry, I just... I better be more careful next time. Don't mind me! I'm just blowing you up! of the commercial facility. The people of the old world must have led pretty good lives. I bet it was fun to shop back when you had so many choices. We don't need such things. Don't be so sure about that. Once we eradicate the machine life forms, us soldiers won't have anything left to do. We'll enter a new age of peace. And when that happens, we should go shopping together. I could buy you, I don't know, a t-shirt maybe? Something that looks good on you. A t-shirt? What, not interested? Hmm. When that day comes, I'm all for it. That's a promise, right? Yep. Hmm. Huh. That's a strange flower. Analysis. It is a plant known as a lunar tear. A lunar tear. What are huh? you... When did you get here? So this flower is called a lunar tear. Seeing that dredges up all kinds of memories. Some of them are a bit strange, honestly. Like the one where I'm being attacked by a giant boar over and over again? Or another where I keep trying out new parts every time my body is damaged? Sounds rough. Something about this flower fills me with an emotion I don't really understand. Lust? It's like something's pushing down on my chest really hard. So, um, do you mind if I ask you a favor? If you find lunar tears growing anywhere else, would you let me know? I want to try and figure out what this feeling is all about. What do you say? Oh man. Aw, oh, thanks. If you find another lunar tear, just let me know on this frequency, all right? I'm counting on you. Wow, he's fast. That's it. Aw, oh, jeez. This is a lunar tear, right? We'd better let Emil know. Hey there, guys. What's up? We found a lunar tear. It's located at... Stay right there! I'm coming! Uh, okay. I hope he doesn't expect me to just stand here all day. Sorry to keep you! Yeah. Oh, hey. Now that I think about it, this whole area was once... Are you remembering something? It's all pretty fuzzy, but I seem to have a memory of caring for this flower a long time ago. But the sand kept expanding, and the flowers gradually wilted. Now that I think about it, that was around the same time I stopped seeing people. You mean humans? Thanks a bunch for finding this, really. Oh, and let me know if you find any more, okay? I'm gonna stay here for a bit. 
It sounds like he used to be in the desert. Don't tell me there's one in the desert too. Ooh, what's this? Oh, uh, what did I say? Hmm. Desert. Nailed it. You're androids, yes? Then you must be here to kill me. I've lived long enough, I only ask that you not make it too painful. Why do you not strike? Because you have no desire to fight? You're like the machines in Pascal's village. If you don't attempt to harm us, we have no cause for quarrel. You know Pascal, I see. Still, you should be careful. Of what? Some of our kind can be violent. They're beyond our control. They attack everything they see, be it friend or foe. Many of these machines are waiting in the canyon. You'd be wise to keep your distance. A challenge, eh? Machines attacking indiscriminately. Proposal. Unit 2B should eliminate the hostile machines. I like his style. You're telling me you want me to go all the way back to that random nobody machine? Hold on. Is that what you're trying to tell me, video game? Oh, you bastard. That's totally what it is. Over here? Over here? This one. Change of plans? No! Come on. It's you again. We have a question about the machines in the canyon. Very dangerous. You should avoid them. Actually, we already took care of them. Then perhaps they can finally reach heaven. Come again? Many machines have thrown themselves into that canyon of late. Suicidal machines. Bad sign. They're trying to hurt themselves. You found the remains of those who su succeeded and fought those who did not. I know not what would drive them to do such a thing. But I pray regardless of their- that their souls might reach heaven. A gift. Thanks for killing them. That's what I do. I kill people. Oh, you're a vendor! Ah, plug-in chip vendor. These stink! No thanks. It's a lunar tear. I'd better tell Emil. I remember seeing this before, but I couldn't interact hey with it. What's going on? I found one of those flowers you were looking for. It's over at- Don't move an inch! I'm coming! How does he always Don't know? Move. I'm actually kind of busy. Sorry to keep you! Damn, you're fast! Uh, that's it. I remember now. Back when the aliens first invaded, I fought as hard as I could to save Earth. You did? I think- I had something I wanted to protect. Something really precious to me. But I don't know what it was. Ooh, a hot young thing. Thank you for finding this. You'll let me know if you find any more, right? I'm gonna stay here for a bit. All right, we made it back to the game dev machine because apparently he's got another quest for me. Oh, I'm turning one in. Presto, my amazingly fun game is now more difficult. Care to check it out? I'll give you a prize if you can debug it. All right, last time it was hugging a wall and that sort of like, hmm. 
Let's see how difficult this is really going to be. That's it? What the hell? That was easy. Oh, three pristine cables. And three titanium alloy. You know something? I don't think my fun game is hard enough yet. We need to reach beyond typical market boundaries to include hardcore gamers. But that could be easily rectified if you bring me a five color cable. You can salvage them from machines in the desert. Creativity's my friend. Boo. All right, so I got another cable, and I'm pretty sure over here is a meal's flower. So I love it when two quests overlap each other in location. Makes my life a lot easier. All right, let's take a peek. You guys see it? I don't see it yet. Oh. Um, I guess it's above. How do you get there? Oh, no. What the hell? Huh. There must be a different way to get there. Let me double check what this is for. Yep, it's here somewhere. Okay. Man, finding this Emil thing was a, such a huge pain in the ass. I went through- oh shit! Oh, I should pay attention. Whew. Hopefully I never have to go through those caves ever again. I don't know what a mysterious lithograph is, but let me save while I'm here. It's a lunar tear. I'd better tell Emil. Hey there, what's up? I found a lunar. I'm on my way. Sorry to keep you. As see, I don't know how he always, got I here see. in his car. Oh, oh. that's right. What happened here, Emil? I was fighting the aliens. It wasn't going well. So I decided to create multiple versions of myself to help with the fight. But the aliens just kept coming. I lost so many friends that day. It was a long time ago, but still. Say, Emil, how old are you anyway? I'm not sure. I didn't need that memory to fight. Thank you for finding this. You'll let me know if you find any more, right? I'm gonna stay here for a bit. Are you serious? We're not done yet? Hold on. How many more are there? Where is this? By the resistance camp. Oh, actually, no. Instead of the resistance camp, the flooded city makes way more sense. And I could go there. I could go to the flooded city coast. Hmm. But this video, I think this video has been pretty long, despite it being all side quests, a ton of fast forwarding. So I'm going to go ahead and end this here. Next time, we'll, we'll try and do the game dev machine, as well as Emil's memories and see what else we got. Then we'll go back to the main quest. So stay tuned and thanks for watching. Bye-bye.